Doug, time for the mid play. Make it happen, man. All right, I'll see if I can work in a mid play for you. CS? CS? Uh, I don't think we're playing CS today. We're just going to the poker. You know what the mid play is, Jamo? Oh, the mid? No, no, no. It's, it's a poker term. I know. Uh, I know the mid play. So, you know how, like, you know how if someone bets on the flop, you have, like, a choice. You can fast play, you can slow play? Yeah. Well, I have the mid play. Oh, it's the mid play. You call it in your lead turn. Oh, uh, that is the mid play. It's the mid play. It's you like know? Connor Drynan, if you will. Oh, he does that? He, he played a hand in the super high roller where he check out. I, I guess it's the mid play of the turn. If you check out, check out that river and got jammed on at the boss and pulled it like a flush. Oh. Owned. Owned. So the mid play. The problem with the mid play is like it can work, but it's really a double edged sword, you it's know? Kind of <laughs> up, right? If you do the mid play, they just know you have a mid hand. Right, that's what I think. Actually, uh, Ma uh, Jason Mercier. Got me in the hundred in the high yeah, mid play, the lead middle pair. Yeah. The mid play. The, the, no, it was the, it was no, that wasn't the scoop. Oh, that was the scoop. He led he led eight. So under the gun opens in the super high roller. Yeah. Small blind calls. It's Jason. I call big blind. Seven six two. He leads the small blind with eights. It's the mid play. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Yeah. You know, I don't see anything wrong with that. All right, guys, we're going all in here with our pair of nines. All in. He's up against. A wrap. Five. Five. Yeah! You're dead to me! You're dead to me!